హలో నమస్తే దిస్ ఇస్ రోహిణి మెరుగు ఫ్రమ్ వల్చంద్ ఇన్స్టిట్యూట్ ఆఫ్ టెక్నాలజీ టాకింగ్ అబౌట్ గన్ డయోడ్ లర్నింగ్ అవుట్కమ్స్ అట్ ద ఎండ్ ఆఫ్ ద వీడియో యూ విల్ బీ ఏబుల్ టు డ్రా అండ్ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ ద బేసిక్ స్ట్రక్చర్ ఆఫ్ గన్ డయోడ్ యూ విల్ బీ ఏబుల్ టు ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్ ద వర్కింగ్ ఆఫ్ గన్ డయోడ్ యూజింగ్ ద టూ వ్యాల్యూ థేరీ కంటెంట్స్ దీస్ ఆర్ ద కంటెంట్స్ ఆఫ్ మై వీడియో let us look what is a gun diode gun diode is nothing but a microwave device it's a microwave oscillator which operates on the principle of transfer electron mechanism and it is invented by jb gun so named uh, after him as gun diode it is nothing but a semiconductor like gallium arsenic indium phosphate or cadmium cadmium telluride so it's simple a wafer of gallium arsenic indium phosphate or cadmium cadmium telluride so to which the leads are attached anode in cathode it works as a gun diode so it works on the principle of uh, two valley theory uh, two valleys one is lower valley this is upper valley each has different mobility and mass so if i see at lower valley the mass is 0.68 so mobility is higher which is 8000 cm square per volt second if i look at the upper valley which has the mass is high 1.2 effective mass is 1.2 so mobility is reduced which is 180 cm square per volt second when dc voltage is applied across the material electric field is established across it at low electric field in the material most of the electrons will be located in the lower valley and at high field the electrons will will be shifted to the upper valley and at high field all the electrons will be transferred to upper valley so the detail i can explain here like initially the electrons are in the valence band when we apply the electric field the for, and sufficient electric field so that the forbidden gap is overcome and the electrons will move to the lower valley when the electrons move to the lower valley uh, still if we increase the electric field so the electrons will start transferring to upper valley and when all the electrons transfer to the upper valley then there is no change in current will be observed let us try to understand the characteristics of gun diode and sinking along with its uh, explanation of two theory or two valley model so this is gun diode characteristics this way as you can see initially the gun diodes part if i see it's a j versus e characteristics so initially it's a, there is a really linear relationship now i can also called as this as a vi characteristics why because j is proportional to i and e is proportional to v in the before the threshold or e less than el e less than el at this point you can see there is a linear relationship between j and e or v and i so as voltage increases current increases so this will happen up to the threshold point eth after that even if the voltage is increased or e is increased current or j will drop and this part is called as negative resistance region and after certain point e greater than eu the current or j will remain constant almost constant even if e is or voltage is increased now we can explain this with the two valley theory when e is less than el all the electrons are in the lower valley in the lower valley the mass is less mobility is higher so current is higher when the electrons tra start transferring to the upper valley in the upper valley mass is more mobility is less as mobility is less current starts dropping current starts reducing when all the electrons transfers to the upper valley the current is reduced a lot and will be remaining almost constant this is called as a saturation region so the electron density is remain same in the, un, under the equilibrium condition when applied electric field is lower e less than el no electrons transfer to the upper valley when e less than el no electrons transfer to upper valley 
when applied field is between el to eu that is greater than el and less than eu the electrons will transfer to upper valley so between el and eu so between this range the electron will start transferring to upper valley when applied electric field is higher than eu e greater than eu all the electrons will transfer to upper valley as you can see here so e greater than eu all the electrons transfer to upper valley as the mobility is less in the upper valley current reduces this leads to negative resistance effect now let us talk about the conductivity in each region when e is less than el the conductivity sigma can be given as e mu l and l where e is the electron charge mu is the electron mobility and n is the electron density and l is for lower value mobility and lower value electron density then between el to eu the conductivity sigma can be given as e mu l n l plus mu u n u because the electrons are available in both the values upper and lower u stands for upper l stands for lower when e greater than eu so in that case e sigma is e mu u n u that is all the electrons are transferred to upper valley so let us talk just about the upper valley mobility and charge concentration the domains are formed in the wafer and the domains move along the from cathode to anode so here that is explained here this is the wafer length from this end to this end there is a wafer length it is on this side if i consider cathode on this side if i consider anode so a sample of uniformly doped n type gallium arsenic of length l let me assume this length as l is biased with the field in the negative conductivity region resulting in the space charge instability when high electric field intensity is applied there is a space charge instability and formation of domain the domains will be formed like this and these domains or the current pulse will move across towards the anode from cathode to anode so under this negative conductivity region the domain builds up because of the stream of electrons drifting from cathode to anode and this time what is the oscillation frequency the oscillation frequency in the transit time of the electrons is given as f is equal to vd upon l v is the drift velocity and l is the length of the wafer and this is the oscillation frequency let us talk about advantages and disadvantages of gun diode gun diode advantages there are the these are the cheapest source of microwaves but comp with comparison with the klystron tubes they are compact in size they operate over a large bandwidth and possesses the high frequency stability over the large bandwidth it has a high frequency stability disadvantage they have a high turn on voltage to turn on we need to provide high voltage and they are less efficient below 10 gigahertz so above 10 gigahertz they are efficient but below 10 gigahertz efficiency is less and they exhibit poor temperature stability gun diode finds applications number of numerous applications of gun diode are there first is in electronic oscillators to generate the microwave energy in parametric amplifiers as a pump sources in police radars also gun diode are used as a source of microwave frequencies in automatic door openers traffic signal controllers in such cases also gun diode is used gun diodes are used in microwave receiver circuits they are used in radio communications they are used in military systems they are used as a remote vibration detectors used in tachometers in pulsed diode gun diode generators in micro electronics as control equipments as well as in continuous wave doppler radar so in all these different applications gun diodes are used these are the references used for preparing this video thank you